Hey everyone, welcome to Digit.in and today we are actually take, getting our first look at the, a prototype of ASUS's project Precog. Now, Precog generally tends to refer to AI or to cognition and things like that. So yeah, the name is kind of appropriate because there is a ton of AI go, that will be going into this machine. Even in the prototype that was shown off, some features were already functional while others are not. So what exactly is Project Precog? This is essentially a laptop with two displays. So as you can see, this is a display on top. It's running Premiere Pro. And at the bottom, you can see a video, a messaging window, and a keyboard layout. So there's a bunch of interesting things going on here. And what ASUS basically said was, you can of course use this machine as is. This laptop can be used as is. The secondary display becomes a full keyboard. You can even pull up a trackpad. However, if you do attach an external mouse and keyboard, you can use those too. And now here's where the AI comes in. If for ex so for example, if you set up the machine that way and you've got a keyboard but you remove the mouse, a trackpad will automatically appear on the machine. So that's in book mode right now. This is in the regular laptop configuration. This machine can also be set up in a flat mode for let's say gaming or especially for people who are into board games this could be pretty interesting and there is also a tent mode so you can use this in four different configurations and on the outside that's what it looks like it's a gorgeous piece of metallic finish try and get closer so you see these lines it's kind of it follows a little bit of the zenbook circular design philosophy but there are very distinct laser etchings on here, giving it a very interesting sheen. The machine itself is very thin, as you can see. Um, it's got a bunch of USB-C ports, uh, which I'll show you right away. So you can see the USB-C port over here, and essentially a placeholder for where a micro SD or an SD card slot would go. This could actually just be a tray, I'm not really sure. Not allowed to touch these machines, so can't tell. But there is also space for an SD card slot, or rather they're supposed to be. The hinges are standard hinges, as you can see. And unfortunately, there is absolutely no details on what hardware this machine is running. We don't know what Intel processor is being used. We don't know how much RAM there is. We don't know battery. We don't know anything about it, except for the fact that this laptop when it launches, if it launches at all, is going to be infused with a lot of AI. The two machine, or rather the one machine, is incredibly thin. As you can see, there's no, again, no specifics on dimensions. If anything, in fact, this could not even be the final design. But what we do know is that the prototypes we're seeing today are extremely thin. And, uh, yeah, there is literally no scope for any kind of slimming down so you see the USB-C port over there and the two displays work seamlessly together so again this use of AI in intelligently managing the content on the display so that's the project uh, precon from ASUS uh, currently in prototype stage no word on when it will be available if it will be available but it is interesting because both executives from Microsoft and Intel came on stage to kind of share the space with ASUS and announce this machine. Um, so yeah, looking forward to it. If and when it comes out, it would be a great machine to test out and to see what kind of uh, functionality we can get out of it, what kind of power we can get out of it, and exactly how functional and efficient it will be in daily life, whether it's for typing, uh, because people love that key feedback when they type. But since this is a display, not really sure how that's going to work out. So we're going to have to wait and watch as to how this plays out. But so this is your first look at the ASUS Project Precog. Thank you guys for watching. And in case you like this video, make sure to subscribe to our channel as we bring you more exciting coverage from Computex directly in Taiwan. Thank you guys for watching. This is Swapnil.